slut sucking boyfriends out. So go shoot them. Just kill them all, Buck. That's that. Buck, it's me, Phil, your divorce lawyer again. You remember how to move and jump and everything, right? There's shit on the screen that tells you how to do all that stuff. I mean, come on, Buck. This is the second. All right, Buck. You're gonna have to use the brand new double jump to get over there. Oh shit! I'm sorry, Buck. I forgot. There's no double jump. Just crouch. We gotta try crouching, Buck. Fucking scheduling and scoping bullshit. A fucking crouch prioritized over a double jump. Who is this? Who, who, who are these people above us? All right, that's a good crouch, Buck. That's a good crouch. Good boy. Good boy. All right. Fucking scoping and scheduling bullshit. Fucking double jump. Stay sharp, Buck. A bunch of your ex-wife's new alien boyfriends. There they are. Coming right at you. Just shoot them, Buck. You remember how to shoot, don't you? Shoot, Buck. That's what I'm talking about, Buck. Kill those fuckers. You're the man. I love you, Buck. You're so fucking cool. Oh, I'm so excited and lit up to be your divorce attorney. You have no idea you're my favorite client. All right, Buck. Oh my god, Buck, you did it. You opened the door. You're a fucking genius. You are my favorite client. It's me, by the way, your divorce attorney. Don't forget, I'm Phil, your divorce attorney. Let's go. Let's get moving. Let's defeat your ex-wife. Say goodbye to mom and dad before they left for their trip. You know they were pissed, right? Whatever. We got the place to ourselves now. Oh my god. Don't give me that look, narc. What, are you mad that I'm throwing this party tonight? <laughs> it's fine. Mom and dad are gone for a whole fucking week. We can do whatever we want. Here, come on. Try some. <laughs> you know it's good for your depression, right? Okay, we're totally gonna rage tonight. I cannot wait. I gotta text Jen and make sure she brings the good shit. Uh, did you know she almost got a DUI? Don't tell anyone. That is a secret, but everyone already knows. <laughs> whoa, 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 it's kicking in. Uh, what is wrong with your face? Like I- Ugh, finally, there you are. I felt like I was losing my mind. So, do you want any or nah? Fine, more for me then. All right, I'm gonna go get ready for the party. This stuff's gonna last me all week. It is powerful. Mom told me I was in charge. She did it in secret so it wouldn't hurt your feelings and dad said that he flat out doesn't love you. It was actually pretty messed up. By the way, mom left you a note on the fridge. Go read it. Then come meet me outside. I need your help grabbing party shit from the store. You come in or what? Come on.
So I guess. Holy shit! Oh, what the fuck? Get down and stay quiet. I knew aliens were real. it called uh dementia uh, what's going on out here martha is that you oh my god oh my god what did they just do to mr pilfrey <laughs> hola me mato it's a what the fuck is going on cho machita wana ho wo no man de tanda una va ti wana kanga ma out of me. It's the metal thing stuck in me. Just pull it out. What the fuck is that? Oh, that feels so much better. Thank you. Yeah, sorry about the spit. I I, I needed to get you infected with the translator microbes. That that's sort of how it works. I guess you guys don't have those here yet. Listen, my name's Kenny. I'm a Gatlian. Uh, we we got to kind of we got to oh, move. What is it? Is it talking to you? Maybe we should go back to the Ignore house. Her. It's very important that you listen to everything I say. Okay, it is your lucky day right now. We can survive this together if you just listen to me. These three guys are gonna turn your whole species into drugs. Can you handle a gun? Because you know I'm kind of a gun, and if you don't use me to kill those G3 grunts, you, you know they're gonna fucking kill us. All right, first kill. I am so glad you picked me up. So let's keep going. All right. Well, here you go. It's a G3 warp base. We can just clean up and warp out of here. Nice. You, you, you know, you had to kill them, right? It was either them or you. And me as well. And, and I, I, I would prefer to live. You know, and I have a voice here. I have a choice in this. Oh, shit. It's a murder. They're coming. I have two men into the base. Shit. We lost them. Just killed an alien. 
I don't know, microwaves? I know it's a lot to ask. What? Like a fucking microwave? Oh, whoa. You can understand your gun now. Translator microbes, they're contagious, but please just move past all this shit! Yeah, sorry, I know you're a bit shaken up, but you'll be fine. It's better than getting enslaved by the G3. Trust me. I guess, how the hell are we gonna get back to Earth? Uh, we can't. You're going out there? Into space? Yeah! Welcome to fucking space! So, this is Blim City. Not, not bad, huh? I don't know how we're gonna find Gene, though. Let's just ask around. There's all kinds of aliens out here. Let's just, let's just ask. He, he is famous. Hey, we're looking for Gene Zaruthi and the bounty hunter. Any idea where he might be? Who? N no. Do you know how many freaking people live here? And you expect me to know this this guy? No. No, no, of course not. Okay, not everyone's gonna be helpful. Hey, oh, uh oh, you don't want to talk to me? Okay, no problem. Yeah, right. Okay, this isn't going so well, but j let's keep asking around. We'll find something, I, I swear. Where the hell is he? Blim City's always been his headquarters, you know? We can't give up. Unauthorized warp detected. Blend City Plaza is under temporary lockdown. Shit, I guess that's our fault, huh? Let's just try looking around here for now. Excuse me, do you have any idea where Gene Zaruthian is? What? That's my name. I'm Gene Zaruthian. But why would you... Oh, wait. You're probably thinking of the famous bounty hunter with the same name as me. Sorry. I'm just some loser accountant. Oh, man. Oh, that's not good. Oh, okay. Uh, okay, I guess you don't need my help. Hey, uh, excuse me, does the bounty hunter Gene Zaruthian live around here? The bounty hunter Gene Zaruthian? <laughs> uh, you must be confused. Uh, uh, please go. Well, what did you mean by that? Okay, God, someone has to know where Gene is. Please stop talking to me. Sorry, shot in the dark here, but are you familiar with the Gene Zaruthian? Who? Oh yeah, he's, he's homeless. He's sleeping on a bench right nearby. I just walked past him earlier. I'm really glad I could be so helpful. What? Really? Uh, okay, well, thank you so much. Shit, he's homeless? Good, fuck him, let's go! You know, I wouldn't be surprised if he's just taking a quick outdoor nap in between big bounty hunting gigs, you know? So I guess Gene's sleeping on a bench near here? You know what, I bet the guy on the bench isn't Gene. It just doesn't really make sense to me. I'm, I'm, 
you know, I, I was thinking you'd have like a big bounty hunting office, you know, we could visit and, you know, a bunch of cool bounty related things in there. Uh, maybe a receptionist. All right, come on, let's go find the guy on the bench. I, I, I don't think it's Gene, but it's our only lead. You can't shoot these open. You, you gotta have something to cut them open, you know? I think we can take a quick break from killing. You know, it's not gonna kill you. Hey, don't even think about going down to the slum. Yeah, this is a maintenance only share. Subscribe. We can't open those yet. We're gonna need something sharp. Unauthorized warp detected. Blend City Plaza is under temporary lockdown. Hey, well, don't shoot the hook bug. That's probably somebody's pet. Yeah, we can't get inside that lug locks without something really sharp. So this is your bedroom, huh? It's fine. I mean, I don't, I, don't, I don't really know what I was expecting, to be honest.
Franz Warp detected. Glen City Pulsar is under temporary lockdown. Shoot everybody. Uh, hello? Get away. They'll take my shit. Oh my god. It, it can't be. What do you want? Y you're not the famous bounty hunter Gene Zaruthian, are you? Who's asking? You're, you're really Gene. Yeah, I'm really Gene. That's me, like on the ads. Disappointed? Guess how I feel. Uh, okay, well, whoopsies. Huh. We were gonna ask for your help fighting the G3 cartel, but... Kid, do I look like I can help anyone? I just got evicted. I don't even have a goddamn home. Can, can you point us in the direction of, you know, a, a, a bounty hunter friend that's still working, you know, still has their legs? Ho, oh, ho, ho, ho. Look at that nice house. God damn. Where'd that come from? That's a great fucking house. You see that house? Huh? Oh, yeah, I do. Yeah, th that's this hairy alien's house, the one holding me. Ah, damn. Can't stop looking at that beautiful house. Uh, yeah, okay. The gears are turning. Maybe I can help you. You can? Uh, but you just said... Yeah, 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 yeah. I, I, I said I'd help you fight the... Who, who'd you say? The, the G3 cartel? Oh, yeah. Okay. <laughs> Come on, that's crazy, but... Okay, well, whatever, whatever. Yeah, 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 sure. We'll, we'll kill them all. Easy. <laughs> I've got a fully operational bounty suit in my cart over there. Really? Well, that's, that's convenient. Yeah, I could turn that hairy kid of yours into a true blue bounty hunter. But if they die... I want the house. That's the trade. Are you sure? I, I don't think they've even fired a gun before today. And and wait, wait you, you want the house in return? Yeah. This is a great deal for you. I mean, you get all my old bounty hunter shit and I might get a house. I, I don't know. Enough talking. J just be a gun for a second. You, hairy kid, put on the suit. See how you feel. Then make a decision, yeah? I can always just pawn this shit off. Okay, g go ahead. Try it on. What choice do we have? You look great, kid. A natural. <laughs> Definitely not gonna die on your first bounty. All right, I guess we'll give it a shot, but I, I don't know about this. Ah, yeah, shit. It's still in trial mode. I pawned off the activation license. The ticket should be in one of your pockets. Some loose change, too. Should be enough. Take that down to Mr. Keep's pawn shop, and he'll get you all set up. The suit will help you get there. Hey there, Gene Zaruthian. It's me, Sudo, your helpful bounty hunting assistant. Before I enable mobility, I just need to make sure your info scanner is online. Can you go ahead and give the area a quick scan for me? Okay, perfect. Great job. I've identified your current objective. Head on down to Mr. Keep's pawn shop. Can you see the waypoint? Perfecto mundo, everything is in working order. Mobility unlocked. You are free to move, Gene. All right. I'll get things set up at your house while you're gone. Ooh, oops, sorry about all those pop-ups. I forgot to warn you about that. Um, you can close them with the interact button, but they are gonna keep coming back nonstop. Uh, that's just gonna keep happening until you activate the license. Sorry, you better hurry up. Uh, okay, let's just head to Mr. Keeps, I guess. What's up, Free? Jorb, greet the customer properly. Welcome to Mr. Keeps, dipshit. We're your friendly neighborhood pie shop. I thought or don't, nobody even cares. Jorb! <laughs> Oh, so old Zaruthia doesn't feel like pawning his license key anymore. What? Did he win the sweepstakes? Ha! Okay, so you want this license key. But, but it's really nice. I kind of want it for myself. You've got enough useless shit. 
Dad! Fine, take it. It's yours. Okay, fuck yeah. Activation license accepted. Bounty hunting suit is in perfect working order. Time for an important question. Would you like to keep me on as your permanent in-suit advisor? That was the best choice you could have made. All right, bye-bye now. I'll be back a bunch. Whoa, not bad. It's got your vital readings, armor levels, even my biometrics. Gene really came through, didn't he? I told you he'd be great. Perfect. Just what this galaxy needs. Another good-for-nothing bounty hunter. Out of my star! All right, bounty hunter. I guess let's head back to the house and check in with Gene. You'll find it. You'll figure it out. Hey, you can run, you know. You, you, I don't know if you do that. Try hitting the button on your screen. I, I can't say the name of the button because I have no fucking clue what kind of controller or keyboard you're using. Huh, there's there's little guys coming out of your house. That Okay. Nice house you got here. Real ritzy. Way better than mine. Oh, wow, you really made yourself at home, huh? Oh, there you are. Who's this weirdo, and why is he setting up a fucking huge alien computer in our living room? Okay, first of all, that alien computer is a very expensive and surprisingly operational Bounty 5000. So, uh, you're welcome. A what 5000? Your kid here thinks they're gonna be a big bad bounty hunter. I set them up with some fancy equipment, so they're letting me have the house when they die. Kid? They're not my kid. I'm their sister. How old do you think I am? Listen, hairball, I don't know what kind of alien you are or how fast you age. I'm just making my best guesses here. You were only gone five minutes, and you already told some random alien he could move in with us. That's what you did. Look, I know it's a lot all at once, but we need him to save your species. So, do you think you could put up with him for a bit? Well, yeah, if it's gonna So happen. what, we just jump into the deep end and start hunting down G3 officers, or, or what? I'm not sure you're ready just yet. I mean, they don't let you fuck the glumpers at glumpies without a level 4 fuck pass, do they? What? I, I don't know. Well, they don't. Maybe I should send you out on a little test run first, eh? Uh, okay, sure. I've got just the thing. A small-time local gangster by the name of Nine Torg. She took my favorite knife. She's got an operation out in the slums. Maybe you kill her and get my knife back. <laughs> then we'll talk. Maybe take you out to Glumpy's to celebrate. All right, so we, we just head out to the slums? No, moron. You gotta use the Bounty 5000 to initiate a bounty. That's what I went through all the trouble of setting it up for. Okay, Jesus. Shit. Normally that door would open up a gateway that lets you walk right through it. So what do we do? Calm down. The bounty's right here in Blim. You mind just heading out on foot? The slums gateway ain't too far from here. I'll get the Bounty 5000 all fixed up while you're gone. Yeah, sure. All right, l let's go, Bounty Hunter. Don't forget to get my knife! We're looking for the gateway to the slums, I guess. Look, it shouldn't be too far. L listen, just follow the waypoint. That's why you're wearing that fancy suit, isn't it? I mean, it's, it's got the augmented reality thing on it, right? Hello, citizens. I'm Blim City Magistrate Clug Nugman, and I have heard your concerns. Murder rates are on the rise. The city's water supply has... Hey, uh, kid, uh, excuse me, can we get our, uh, we need to make our way into the slums, please? No. Hold on. So you really want to get into the slums, huh? Then settle a bit for oh, us. Come on, come on. Don't, don't, don't make him answer this one. No, wrong. I want to know. It's fine. We'll, we'll help. Okay, great. If you saw us at the bar, which of us would you ask out? You don't have to be this way. As chancellor under my five-year plan, uh, the blue guy. Exactly. That's what I figured you'd say. Yeah, everyone always says him. Hey, don't feel bad, man. You're still plenty hot. I'm just hotter. Blue's a hotter color. That's that's science. I know. I know. I know. I just I just wish one time someone would say I'm hotter. 
You know, I put so much work in. I watched all those skin and heel tutorials, and I got surgery, so I don't have to poop anymore. That's your problem. It should be effortless. Everyone can sense all that desperation, all the sadness. Just radiating from you. But me, I'm just true blue, all natural hot, baby. Is it true? Am I, am I just really a lost cause? Be honest. Yeah, you, you can't match up to the blue guy. Look, I'm sorry. That's just how it is. God, you don't have to be so blunt about it. I, I'm pretty fragile, you know? Don't worry about him. He's weak and disgusting. He doesn't get what it's like for us hot people. Sorry for making you talk to him. Can I uh, make it up to you by letting you use my door anytime you want? Free passage in and out of the slum. Whoa, really? That, that would be amazing, actually. Oh, well, have fun using his door, because mine's shut forever for you. Yeah, so what do you think now, huh? You still think I'm ugly? Yeah, well, you I think we handled that as best we could, you know? Broke Not interested. Coming down that pipe. Be Sorry to hear that. Well, well. <laughs> Look what we got here. Fresh meat. Hey there, fresh meat. Whoa, 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 whoa. what are you doing? Come on, he's just a kid. Meat. Don't shoot him. Oh, you don't want to shoot me just because you're a I'm not shooting a kid. <laughs> you shot me, I'm dead. Eh. All right, there. Are you happy now? Well, I, I didn't think we'd be allowed to kill him. Yeah, normally, killing children in games isn't isn't allowed, but What's he's like dead. We killed you this kid. Are, are you happy now? We killed a kid. A kid is dead now. There goes our E for everybody rating. Attention, Bloom City citizen. You are wearing an unregistered bounty. Shit, shirt. we gotta Prepare take down these to drones. Finally happened. Someone killed my son. Y your son? Yep. The kid up there who always calls everyone fresh meat. We are so sorry. Listen, don't get used to that. We're not killing any more kids. I'm drawing the line, so savor it. Enjoy it. It happened. Tuck it away in the old memory book. No, it's fine. <laughs> You can't pass through here. It's Nine Torg's turn. Jesus, enough with everyone getting in our way. We just want to kill Nine Torg. Yeah, right. You kill Nine Torg. Hey, what are you doing? What the fuck? Holy shit! Jason, Jason's dead. Oh shit! Here we go. We're gonna have to kill some of these poor foot soldiers to prove ourselves around here. These people think we're weak. Not on my watch. What are you? Some kind of bounty hunter? The slums are full, asshole. Yeah. This is Nine Torg's turn. The coolest turn. Shit, they're shooting at us. Come on, shoot back. Come on, shoot back. It's gonna be so easy to kill you. Nine Torg trained us real good. We're the toughest enemies in the game, I think. Hey, stay where I can see you. Another wave, no problem. be going on L let's look around for somebody who can help us i'm 
so lonely over here. I got all this great information I could share. I'm just sitting here, fishing away. Hello there, friend. Can I help you? Do you know how we can get to Nine Torg? Buddy, all I know is fish, and I barely know fish. But let's just pretend there's a laundromat you can sneak through to get to Sludge Works over there. Are we pretending, or is there really a laundromat? Come on, kid, take the hint. Either we're pretending, or Nine Torg's goons kill me for squealing. Okay, I got it. We're pretending. Oh, Christ, just follow that path along the sludge. Uh, you're a wise old fisherman. Can you tell us a little bit about Nine Torg? Quiet. She's got ears everywhere, or antennae, whatever ants here with. Is she really that dangerous? Come on. I mean, she's just one gang lord. Just one? <laughs> what about the other eight Torgs? Wait, so the nine and nine Torg is, it's a counter? There's nine Torgs? Nine clones, yep. And that's just what's left. There used to be even more of them, but they always kill each other. Fighting for dominance over what? This hellhole? <laughs> This month, nine Torgs in charge. Last month, it was 14 Torg before they killed her. Now, nine Torgs fighting with five Torg. It never ends. Which one do you prefer? Uh, eight Torg is the hottest. So, uh, how do you like living down here in the slums? It's sort of colorful down here, at least. What? Are you serious? This is one of the worst places anyone can live. You can't see that just by looking at it. It's more sludge than anything else, and the sludge is toxic. Oof, sorry. Yeah, that sludge does look pretty awful. No, the sludge is the best part. It's the quickest way out. Just hop in there, and you got a one-way ticket out of here. Imagine if we didn't have the sludge. Then we'd really be trapped. Anyway, yeah, living here is bad. So, uh, what, what exactly are you doing out here? What? I'm fishing. You can tell I'm fishing, right? Oh, right. Duh. Of course. Of course. Sorry. That, it's, it's very obvious. Yes. So, ha have you caught anything? No. Never have. Never will. No fish can live down here in this sludge. If there aren't any fish in there, why are you fishing? What's, what is that? What's going on? Because I'm still working up the courage to drown myself. Yikes. Wow. Okay. TMI, maybe, a little bit. Hey, thanks for the info, uh, wise fisherman. We'll see you later. Have a good day now. Oh, hey, you want to see a cool party trick I used to do? Aim me at those platforms. Come on, come on, give it a shot. It'll be fun. Oh, yeah, I told you. Did you see how fun that was? I call it my glob shot. It comes out of my trick hole. All Gatlians have a different kind of trick hole. My, mine does this. Boy, you are learning a lot today, aren't you? It's another trick up my little slimy sleeve. Try hitting him with my glob shot. Take your time and aim one. You're gonna kill us now, aren't you? Oh, God. Please don't. Don't do that. Don't shoot a gun with your group All right, uh. Yeah, you're having good trouble. That's fine. Listen, just keep trying until you get it. You know, Whoa, perfect shot. You fucking nailed it. How sick was that? Whew, okay. I gotta recharge. It doesn't take too long, but it's a little longer when there's enemies nearby, you know? My, my, my body gets too tense. It's, it's like trying to piss when someone's watching, you know? Oh shit, here come more guys! Go nuts! Use my glove shot and then just shoot them in, in the air and juggle them and it'll, it's gonna look sick, I promise! Thank <laughs> you. 
You're gonna keep coming, Moran. Please. A lot of you shut it up. Looks like he was dyed clean only. Hey, careful with the merchandise. Whoa, hold up a bit. Let's fire listen. Line up and everything. They're gonna be here any minute. Just, just patient. Oi, fuck you! I'm sick of this. I want to tear through someone's guts. Oh, I think they're talking about Gene's knife. Oh, fuck you! Got it, freak. We've had enough of your bullshit. Yeah, it's your fault. Uh, Stop. Who's there? Who are you? Uh, hey, hello there, friends. Oh, I, I think it's the buyer. Hey, are you the buyer? Uh, yeah, we're here to, uh, buy, buy a knife? You guys are selling a knife, yeah? Oh, perfect. You're really late. We were starting to get worried. Just go with it. No shooting. All right, here's the product. A genuine talking knife. I gotta be honest with you. He's a real piece of shit. He's extremely violent. He basically only talks about wanting to kill people in very disturbing ways. Fuck you. I'm gonna carve out your anal cavity. Gonna make it three times as big. Your shit's just gonna drop right out of there. Let's see what I'm talking about? Oh, uh, perfect. That's exactly what... Oh, fuck yes! Thank you! Pleased to meet you. I'm Knifey. Now use me, use me! Let me fucking step in! Oh, fuck yes! Yes, fuck yes! More, more! I need more stabbing! Hey, you, listen. Point me at your raw, fleshy little tummy and jab me right into there. Let's get all those guts torn up. Let's see that fucking red goop spill out. I can't stop now. Oh, uh, that's a pass for us. Is this really the knife Gene was talking about? Gene? Did you just say Gene? Okay, change of plans. Bring me to Gene, so I can fucking decapitate him! Wait, what? Why? He sent us to rescue you! Oh, that's rich. There's no way I'm forgiving him, though, for leaving me with that fucking Nine Torg. He's dead to me! Huh? You know Nine Torg? We're trying to kill her! Oh, perfect! Finally, we're on the same page! Let's kill Nine Torg, then Gene! Okay, definitely Nine Torg, but l l let's put a pin in the, the whole Gene thing. H how do we get out of here? With my tether ability! I'm more than just a knife, you racist! I can tether too! Look up and latch! John. Cool, right? You gotta use me to swing across this sludge. Oh, fuck yeah! Not as good as stabbing, but still pretty good. Well, all right. Where, where to next? The sludge works processing plant. Nine Talk was talking about some traitor she had to deal with. Probably another one of her clones. Five Talk or six Talk or whatever. I don't know. There's too many now. There's too many Talks. How many clones are there? Who the fuck cares? Stop thinking so hard and just look for the big sludge work sign. I want to stab somebody. So you, uh, mentioned that Gene gave you to Nine Torg? Dave, try gamble me away in a game of space poker, that sack of shit. Oh, a lug lock! Use me! I can open those fuckers up real good! And there's loot inside for you too! Win-win, yes! Happened to Gene? Didn't he used to be a hero? Yeah, he used to be. Hard to tell these days, right? Towards the end, the only thing I was cutting for him was sandwiches. Not even the good ones. Peanut butter sandwiches. And no fucking jelly. Not even like ham or anything good. Torg character's deal anyway. She's the current matriarch of the whole family. Why are they current? Because they're always killing each other for the top spot. You know how it is with clones. So I'm not sure what to 
about to happen to me. I'm scared. I'm scared. I'm dying. Oh, hey, there's some Gatorol. That, 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 that'll fill me back up. Whoa, thank Jesus. Okay, feed me that Gatorol, baby. Come on, put it in my little mouth. sure what came over me there i think i got caught up in the moment or something but hey good work team let's go get nine torque any last words five torque is that nine torque talking Fuck off. i've always said you were the worst torque you know seven torque said the same thing right before i killed her damn you and you're next you got this Well, I'm not 
roughly on the best day and, and tethering, but I can also deflect attacks. I'll slice them the fucking dead. I'll cut their fucking heads off. I'll cut their heads off and get them in. I'll fucking do everything. Oh, I'm gonna fucking cut for all of them. Hunter, I, I feel pretty good. I, I, I really didn't know if we'd be able to pull it off. All right, it's time. Time for what? Time to carve out a piece of her. I'm thinking we go with a full slab of thigh meat, but since it's your first, I'll let you pick. Oh, God, I can't look. I can't. I can't. <laughs> oh, fuck. No, she's a gusher. Could have just taken, like, a fingernail, some spit, a, maybe a blood sample? Yeah, sure. Could have, I guess. Hey, I'm Five Torg. Thank you for killing my evil clone. I don't mind if you mutilate her corpse, really. It's fine. You did such a good job. That was, like, off the hook. You're not gonna take over and end up being just as evil as Nine Torg, right? Oh, uh -huh. don't worry. Things are gonna be a lot different around here. So, no more crime, then? Oh, not that different, then. <laughs> Technically, all of us Torgs are evil clones, so I'm still gonna do a bunch of crime. But we're cool. Huh. Far as I'm concerned, you're a friend of the Torg family and welcome here anytime. An honorary Torg. You can be ten Torg. Now, if you'll excuse me, my day just became very full. Are you gonna be okay if we just kind of leave you hanging up there? Oh, oh, yeah. Yeah, I can get down just fine. Hanging from ropes feels nice for my species. Hey, it's good for our backs. I'm, I'm actually the one who put myself here. Thanks for the rescue. Uh, don't mind me. I'm just gonna hang here for a bit. Yeah, next time you come back, I'll be off being really busy running everything and, you know, doing stuff. Because, yeah. Well, hey, hey, what are you doing? Nice! We killed another boss! I, I, I think, like a, a bonus secret boss! G good work! First bounty, hey, you know, that was some pretty solid bounty hunting back there. I mean, I mean, don't don't get too cocky about it or anything, but it, it was pretty cool. Yeah, not bad. That was some good killing. And I'm somewhat of a killing expert, actually. I can't wait to see Gene's face when he sees we pulled this off. Let's head back up through the slums tunnel. Hey, you thought you'd be on the torch, huh? Well, you'll never be me! Just one of them? Easy. I don't know why that guy even bothered attacking us. I almost feel bad. Oh, 
while you're back. Hey, yeah, my leg's still very broken. Welcome back to my amazing place. You. Hey, how's it hanging, pal? Remember, anytime you want to go to the slums, I'm your guy. Far, far hornier than ever. However, there's something plaguing our city far worse than any of those issues. Cold, hard drugs. These figures don't lie. However, things don't have to be this way. As Chancellor, under my five-year plan, all drugs will be eradicated. And that's the Klugnugman promise. Thanks to our new Keep Blim City Clean initiative, we managed to keep drugs. Six feet, please. There's something plaguing our city far worse than any of those issues. Cold, hard drugs. These figures don't lie. However, things don't have to be this way. As Chancellor, under my five-year plan, all drugs will be eradicated. And that... Oh, man. Huh, why is the door closed? I, 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 I'm just a tiny little bambo boy, Who is it? You, know? you got my munch dash delivery? What? Guy. No, it's oh, us! Oh, shit. Really? Good job! Oh, hold on! Is that Jane? Okay, get ready. I want you to stab me right into his fat little belly. Is that you from a uh, human race thing? That no, no, it's not, uh, it's not, it's not the crisscross. From what the hell, Gene? He installed new locks because he assumed you'd get killed. He keeps saying it's his house now. What? No. I just took the liberty of upgrading your security. Did you really kill Nine Talk, though? Yeah, we actually did. Well, well, well. Didn't think you had it in you. I'm really blown away. I'll be honest with you. I expected you to die. Oh, thank you. So, what did it feel like? Killing nine talk. Look, I gotta be honest, it felt good. It felt great. I mean... Hey, Gene, lift up that shirt and expose your soft little belly for me. I'm coming in hot. Yes. Forgot how psycho he was. Why don't you just, uh, hold on to him for now? Oh, sure, yeah, we'll, uh, we'll, we'll keep him far away from you. Yeah, thanks. Now, uh, go turn in your bounty at the Bounty 5000. I got it all set up for you. No, seriously, let me stab him. Well, there you go. You're a real bounty hunter now. Huh, would you look at that? I, I guess we're really doing it. Yeah, I didn't expect you to get your footing so quick. I don't even have any leads on any G3 bounties. 
You're uh, serious about going after them, huh? You bet. We'll, we'll take them all down, including Garmantuous. Well, you're welcome to try. And if you do, you might want to go to the pawn shop and buy back the Dodge unit I pawned off. Forgot to tell you about it. Go scrounge up some pesos and buy that. Or whatever else tickles your fancy. I'll have some G3 bounties ready for you by the time you get back. Sure, sounds good. Thanks, Gene. Just maybe next time don't assume we're just gonna die. Right. Got it. Hello, and welcome to Human TV, your number one choice for the scariest human movies. What, while you were off murdering a gang lord in the slums? How is it down there? Any cool shops, or is it just sort of depressing? Everyone up here just makes the slum sound really depressing. I'm probably just gonna not go down there, to be honest. But it is pretty crazy you killed a gang lord. And she was a woman, though. Not very feminist of you to kill a woman in power. You're really gonna need that Dodge unit from the pawn shop. The suit's not really complete without it. Look, I know Mr. Keeps annoying, but you gotta put up with him and buy back that Dodge unit. So, uh, what kind of stuff did you do in here? Like, anything gross? Okay, fine. You don't wanna go to the pawn shop? Well, I'm not doing any more research on the G3 until you do. Gene said you might have the old Dodge unit that goes with this bounty suit. Oh, yeah. We got that. Why? You want it? I want it, too. So it'll cost you. Uh, yeah, yeah. No, we, we know how buying stuff works. Thanks for your business. Don't buy anything else. All right, there you go. One Dodge unit. Have a nice life. All right, we got it. Let's try this bad boy out and then head back to Gene. What is this taking so long? Okay, great. You got the Dodge unit. So how about it? Think you're ready for the big leagues, kid? What, what do you mean? The big league. The G3 cartel. That's the next step. Taking down their head officers. Okay, um, are you, are you positive that we're ready for that? Yeah, whatever. Might, might as well try. But they won't be pushovers like Nine Torg, so, uh... Well, to be honest, I don't care if you live or die. You know that. You know my whole deal. But, uh, hey, it's your funeral. So go check out the Bounty 5000 whenever you're ready. Got two G3 leads for you right now. Krubus and Douglas. You can pick which one you want to let kill you first.
Zephyr Paradise. Gorgeous, huh? A G3 Grenton. Okay, now the cartel knows we're here. Whoa, whoa, never mind. Listen, if any part of you is feeling bad about killing these little mites, don't. Uh, leading scientists looked into it and uh, they, they, they have no feelings. They, you know, they're just like, I don't know, what do you do on your planet? Like fish? Does that, does that translate right? Translator microbes. It's nice to kill something guilt. Whew. Wow, they only brought me here a couple of times. Looks like they haven't ruined this part of the jungle yet. Oh, these things. Okay, do you know what fan plants are? You shoot the little bud, and then the the thing does the thing it does, and and you know what? You'll 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 figure it out. Okay, yeah, you you figured it out. What do we have here? tunnel no i'm just kidding just some uh, cell phone humor just to lighten the mood you know oh a fergal den oh um, man you, you, you know you actually have a lot in common with these guys you know aside from all the hair you know you're both being sold as drugs to for aliens to get a high off of you know you guys are uh it's, it's like you're almost related in a way you know Whew, geez i didn't want to embarrass them back there but that tunnel reeks of fergal shit here this is great
This hurts me too, you know. Should try launching that Merc with the fan plant. Oh, look at him go! Okay, shit, that village is swarming with cartel guys. How, how, how do I deal with this? runs this sector back. Welcome, welcome. We are Moplets, native to this planet. Our tribe is forever in your debt. Our leader would like to speak with you. Oh, okay, Hello sure. Hello there, savior. My people were enslaved by the G3 and forced to desecrate the land mining for Fergals. You may have freed this small tribe, but our brethren underground are still being worked to death by Krubis. Krubis. You know, we're actually looking for him to kill. What's this? You aim to take down Krubis of the G3? You are truly a hero to Moplets everywhere. Yeah, yeah, sure. Uh, where is he? We'll, we'll get rid of him for you. Hmm. That's difficult to answer. 
His work, though evil, keeps him very busy. He oversees many different mines across Zephyr, and it's impossible to predict where he may be on any given day. My liege, what about the man in the mansion? Of course, a brilliant plan. My advisor is right. There's a man nearby who knows Krubus and has access to a warp device. We may be able to use him. He lives in a mansion across the river. If you could get your hands on his warp device, that could be very useful. Okay, sure. A guy in a mansion. That, 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 that's the plan? Yes. He would appear to be our best chance. Godspeed, savior. Why were you guys all imprisoned? The G3 are a cruel bunch. They did tests on us to see if we could trigger psychedelic reactions like a drug. But when we proved useless in that regard, they put us to work mining Fergals instead. Man, good God, you know, you, you, you just can't win. You're either a drug or you're a slave, I guess. Yes, and those poor Fergals, so helpless. They're making us destroy their lives, their habitats. It's so gruesome. Basically, our lives are super fucked. It's, uh, it's not good. But you freed us. Everything changes now. What's the guy in the mansion like? Oh, his name is Ranchi Delarma. He warped in not too long ago. Seems to be old acquaintances with Krubus. We haven't dealt with him much, but he seems to have a penchant for Fergals. Oh, God, he's a drug addict. Nonetheless, we may be able to use that to our advantage. He does have close ties with Krubus, after all, and he seems a bit disoriented. Right, because of the drugs. A and he's evil still, right? Well, yes, he's evil, so it should be morally just. Yes, let's all just agree right now that it's morally just to manipulate him. I love it when we can agree. C can you tell us a little more about Krubus? I've only come face to face with him a few times, but he's hes an irritable one, that Krubus. I think he resents having to manage the mines. Probably would prefer doing something a bit more glamorous. And he takes all his frustrations out on us. Oh, man, I'm sorry. Sadly, there's nothing that can be done about it. Unless you kill him. That would do the trick. Hey, thanks for your help. Very well. Godspeed, saviors. mediation. Listen, we're busy.
Sometimes there's <laughs> just destroy that. Hey, look, you're on a catapult. I bet you can use that to launch stuff. Will you do it? I want to see. That would be so cool. I love cool stuff. Shit, this guy won't stop. Oh, so, so to continue, oh, it's a nightmare. But I digress, you know, I don't. Did you know that I used to work? Actually, I used to work for the G3. Ha, <laughs> ha. Did you believe that? I deserve it, honestly, and uh, there's a there's a death warrant out for my arrest. And... Oh, look at you go! You're really playing! You're trying to copy me! <laughs> I think you want to be just like me because I'm so cool! Well, tough luck! I'm the only me! Don't try to be me! I fuck you! Does he ever shut up? I've started to take care of the little burgles around my, my sight! them, heal them when they make mistakes, and you know my mother, oh, oh, she, she always said, oh, you'll join G3 one day, you're not good, Princeton, she always would say that about me, you're not good, as if my three hearts couldn't have goodness enough, I don't even want to get started on her, you have no idea what it's like to have a mother who doesn't support your dreams. All I ever wanted to be was a jungle seamstress. I wanted to grab the purple trees and create amazing clothing for the commoners here in Zephyr. But no, no one believes in me. No one gets the court line to save us. So I joined the team 3 out of desperation. That if we had built something, anything, I, I've been aimless most of my life. Someone there? Oh my god, please come over here. Okay, bye. Hey. Have a good day. Look at that. I remember it. That sucks. Position. You must have bought something really good in there. I'm proud of you. In fact, I'm attracted to you. You deserve all the good things you want. And you supported a bumping it up. Local business. <laughs> That's just fantastic. It helps the economy out here in Zephyr Paradise. 
You're helping this shop that's set up somewhere out in the middle of nowhere. That's probably that from all of us. I just realized I'm late for my next date. I'm gonna go fuck another really hot gritten. Wish me luck. It was so late for me. Finally, thank God. I don't know how much more I could have taken. to maintain a place like this, you know? Die, you creaky crawly bastard! Oh, fuck yeah. Oh, hey, you made it. You got my fresh Virgils? What? Yeah, this is the guy we're looking for. Come on, come on, come on. Hand over the Virgils. I, huh, I don't see a warp device on you. Oh, come on, is Krubus making you hoof it around on foot? Oh, that cheapskate bastard. Same old Krubus. I'm telling you, man. <laughs> Here, I got an extra. Don't let anyone ever...
never tell you Ranchi's not a generous fella, okay? There's an unused warp disc in there too, you know? Warp in whatever's on there, I don't care, it's free of charge. There's a river near here, you can probably cross with it. Oh man, go nuts. <laughs> warp a holly. <laughs> Wow, th thank you. Hey, hey, come 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 come. Lean in close. Get close to me, man. I'm sure Krugus told you I'm here on Zephyr to break ground on a new Delarmo Land Resort. Yeah, I'm that ranchy Delarmo, CEO Delarmo Industries. This one's going to be even better than the one on Glassport 12. Trust me, man. That guy's busy as shit, always hopping from site to site. He's got like 30 different mines all across Zephyr. You think I can keep track of that? Fuck. I see him when I see him, okay? I, I wish you'd take some time off, though. Hey, I want to talk to him about Delarmo Land. I, I'm sure you've been to Delarmo Land before, probably the flagship Glashborg 12 location, but buddy, you would not believe the regulations we have. Really? I don't smell anything. There. It smells Ew, just fine in here. Sticklers. So I had a crew bus, you know, make a deal with the G3, and now we're setting up a brand new location here on Zephyr where ain't nobody gonna breathe down our necks about safety protocols or background. All right, oh. okay, we got a warp device. Um, you know, that's gonna be helpful. Why don't we use it to cross this river so we can go talk to the Moplet? and check in with them. Uh, now, where was I? Okay, 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 okay. Now, let me continue. Looks like they're working on fixing this portal. You know, hey, maybe we can use it later, you know? Okay, uh, let's use this warp device Ranchy gave us to cross the river, huh? Hey there, it's me, Sudo. I'm back. Uh, looks like you're trying to use that new warp device you just got. You want me to help you out? That's kind of what we're supposed to do right now. Ranchy? Yeah, that guy has serious problems, but he gave us this warp device. By the gods, you've done it! You got the warp device! This might actually work. You continue to provide us with hope, Grand Savior. With this warp device, you can warp Krubis directly to you. How fortuitous! But alas, you'll need his coordinates and a blank warp disk to encode them onto. Hmm. Oh well! No way you're getting those. That stuff's in the mines. We could just go down there and get it right now. Oh, right. Take this access code and head down to the mines. Everything you need is there. Okay, perfect. Thank you. You know, you, you guys figured out that whole plan for us. You know, that really means a lot. You know, it clears things up for, for us, you know, anyway. Yep, uh, we'll, we'll get it done. I can tell you're pure of heart. Please do not let us down. All right, Jesus. And you are bored. Thank you. Very, very rude. All right, let's use the passcode and get in. Nice. Jeez, are the G3 even trying to domesticate the local mites? Holy 
shit, looks like the G3 ran into trouble. I mean, maybe they'll sort this out themselves. Is this the entrance to the mines? Jesus, they really fucked this place up. I didn't know it had gotten this bad. These guys just don't let up, do they? Oh shit, Grintons. Gotta be honest, uh, you know, they're, they're working for the G3, but still better than our friend from earlier.
All right, now let's try that elevator. Okay, this should take us down into the mines. Going down. Huh? Sorry, I, I almost made a crest joke, but I'm, I'm gonna save it. I'm gonna save. We're better than that. No crest jokes from me. That's a promise. Not from me, anyways. You might warp in some bases, and Lord only knows. But you know, from me over here as a gun character sidekick, no crest jokes. 100% on the level with you, and no bad stuff. ticket and some way to find out where Krubus is. Let's get to work. There's got to be some some way to shut it off somewhere around here. Enjoy the extra fun. Attention, mining operation 12C. It's me, Kubis. Speed things up! I'm fucking underwater here trying to keep things on schedule. And I figured maybe you forgot that if you piss me off, I will kill you. It's really easy to find more slaves. Look, just do your job in my morpher. Holy shit. Hey, he's got a Gatlion. We, we gotta rescue it. Operation 12C. This is Krubus. One of you weird public fucks just delivered me a That's the Virgos. Do you want to know how I know they're defective? Because they're fucking dead. Looks like most of them got crushed in a cave-in. And I punished the mob that's responsible, but it looks like they died in the cave-in too. Don't let it happen again. What's up, fuckers? It's me, Krubus again. 
Someone filled out the wrong shipping destination on an entire stack of Form 40. You fucked up my whole day when you did that. Just come forward and tell me whose fault it was. I wish I could promise you I won't kill you, but I'm definitely gonna kill you! I wish I could promise you I won't kill you, but I'm definitely gonna kill you! I wish I could promise you I won't kill you, but I'm definitely gonna kill you! Again, just bored this time. I've been standing at the paper all fucking day, and my brain's melting. I, I fucking hate the new hires coming in today. No, no, I don't know. What uh, excuse me, <sighs> I've got to go. We'll talk more later. Bye, Merle. I'm so sorry. I didn't see you there. I'm Helen. I just need to know are you the new hire or the new boss? Uh, as a matter of fact, um, I, I am. I am the new boss. Absolutely. Yeah, right. You're not, honey. <laughs> That's funny, though. I like when the new hires have a sense of humor. <laughs> Let's get you all set up. Head on into the next room and find a place to work. Go on without me. I haven't left this chair in years, and I don't plan to start now. <laughs> They're here. Hey, you must be the new office clerk, right? Just sort through that paperwork for us. We're so sorry. Uh, sure. Uh, yes. I will see what I can do. Oh, jeez. Okay, this is more paperwork than I anticipated. All right, better get to work. So, we still good for Hyper Feast later? What time did you say again? Uh, Thorg. Oh yeah, Zork totally works. Hey newbie, you know Hyper Feast? They create new life in front of you and you get to eat it alive? Shit's wild, man. Hyper Feast. <laughs> See you there, girlfriend. You're my girlfriend. We're dating. Oh my god, I'm going insane. I'm going fucking nuts. What? Yeah, I, uh, God, I think my brain's breaking. I, I think doing this job is making my brain break completely. Oh, yeah, me too, me too. It's fun. You don't mind your brain breaking? Well, you don't mind the, this fucking monotonous nightmare work? No, no, it's nice. It's cool to just give into a broken brain. I can't do math anymore. And if I stay here another year, I And done, finally! I can't do math anymore. And if I stay here another year, I think I'll forget how to say three-syllable words. Okay, that honestly doesn't sound so bad. It's not bad. It's terrific. Fantastic. Amazing. Three words I won't be able to say next year, so savor them now. Oh, buddy, I will. You know, I, I kind of don't mind this at all. for Hyper Beast again. God, are you listening to anything? We said Zorg. Zorg. Ah, right, right. Damn. I just remembered I had something. All in a day's work. Glad we got that all done. There, are, there definitely is not going to be a third stack. Ah, uh, the cold sting of irony. Is, is that ironic? I, I never really know. I just remembered I had something going on at Zorg. Holy shit, I, I am, I'm gonna blow my fucking brains out. What? Oh, I didn't see it. Do, do you still sit here? Oh, so funny. 
Yeah, this is still my spot. Okay, yeah, that makes sense. It does, it does, yeah. I, I, I think if I if I sit back down at my desk, my soul is just gonna leave my body. Okay, well, I got work to do. Yeah, I know, me too. I, I, I have to do all this fucking work. This is the whole fucking problem, man. Look, just because we used to be married doesn't mean you can keep leaning on me to work through your issues. That was one night. We got married for one... Oh, okay, we're done. No more paperwork. Did you hear me? I said no more paperwork. Not even a fourth stack. Okay, good. God damn, you filled out those papers like a son of a bitch. Like a real bitch you are. Fuck you. You're, you're promoted. You're free to go into Krubus's office. Why? Because fuck you. That's why I don't need a fucking reason. I'm Boss McBossington. And I'll be in oh, So this office. must be Krubus's office. There's got to be something here we can use. Krubus, where are you? This is Garmantuous. I just checked the log and you're three days behind schedule with the latest shipment. But you oh, would you look at that? He, he marked his coordinates on the calendar. Shit. All right, now we just need a blank warp disk to encode this on. What's going on? Uh, don't, don't give me in trouble. No, no, it's okay. We're friends. We, we hate the G3 too. Oh, wonderful. Thank God. <gasps> Listen, we're looking for a blank warp disk. Do, do you have any ideas? Ah, uh, yes. Our prince has a stash of them. Really? All you need to do is clear out the warp base the G3 plopped on in our holy land. Then you'll reclaim the sacred grounds and rescue Prince Chosen One. And then he'll give us a blank disk? Yes, oh yes. We can, we can help each other. Oh, what a fortuitous happenstance. Oh. oh. So, what's your plan? We have started a resistance. Not only do the G3 oh. enslave us, but they have desecrated our holiest of sites and absconded with our Ugh. sweet prince. Prince Chosen One, that's, that's him. Prince oh, Chosen. that's awful! So, oh. so you kidnapped this G3 merc as a bargaining chip to get your prince back? Oh, huh. yeah, that's smart. No, we, we didn't think of that at all. But it's fine, we know where the prince is. They swamped him out with the rest of our sacred grounds when they warped in a new base. So you want us to go clear it out and then warp the throne room back? Oh, heavens! Would you really do all that for us? The base is just past this tunnel. Thank you, thank you, thank uh, you. Is his name really Prince Chosen One? Yes. He was named as such according to the uh, prophecy. And then after that, he was made a duel. So you trust your leaders to prophecies. Is he a good prince? Well, the prophecy doesn't guarantee he's going to be good at his job. It just tells us who to pick. Look, I, 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 I don't know. I don't know. Look, if now is not the time to criticize us. We're, I'm just, you know, we're distressed as it is. I'm just doing my job. All right, we are off. Oh. Wow, you know, we, we're about to rescue a prince. You know, I'm a, I'm a little nervous. You know, I, I hope he lives up to the hype. Hey, listen, when has a prince ever let anyone down? You know what I mean? Oh shit, this must be the place. Okay, let's clear it out.
head back outside and use this to reverse the warp. What the hell do you want? Jeez, it, jeez, we, we just saved you? You know, maybe you could be a little grateful? Saved me from what? I'm fine. Look, we were told you had some sort of blank warp disc. Huh? Yeah, 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 sure. I've got a bunch. Okay, we got everything we need. Let's get back to Ranchy's place and see if he, you know, can help us encode them onto this machine. Prince Chosen One has returned. All has been restored. Prince Chosen One, I am so sorry, but we're out of Plagor. Can I interest you in some Plagor? I don't want Plagor! I want... <laughs> Let's head inside. Hey, uh, you're back. Oh, thank God. Thank fucking God. Uh, did you bring my Fergal? Uh, I need it bad. Uh, I need my fix, kid. Uh, I need it bad. I need it real bad. Oh, Jesus Christ. Man, hey, are you all right? Uh, are you are you having a heart attack or... or is, it, is it Fergal withdrawals? Does that make you happy? Oh, you love that, don't you? You love to see him. Uh, master of industry, all flummoxed like this, all low and, uh, yeah, maybe, maybe. Uh, uh maybe this is a bad time, but can we use your disc encoder real quick? What? No, the encoder is off limits until I get my goddamn Fergal fix. Fergals, get them. Hurry, hurry, hurry. Uh, hey, tell you what, we're gonna go ahead and use the disc encoder while you're sort of, uh, stuck on the ground like that, doing whatever it is you're doing. So, don't be mad at us. All right, looks like it's working. Oh, I'm in a bad spot, man. All right, there we go. Time to warp so in Krubus and then, you know, kill him if, 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 if we're able to. You ready? Please, get me Fergals! You don't even work for Krubus, do you? Hey, I've got a crazy idea. Swap out this mansion for Krubus' base. Yeah. 
dirt in my mouth. This fucking sucks. <laughs> Looks like they brought back up. And nobody's gonna miss you. <laughs> you can't beat me. I got more left in me. It's purple time, baby. Honestly, how do you even do anything with drills for hands? How do you eat? Right! Look, I'm not judging. I, I, I don't have any hands at all. I, I actually don't even know why I'm barking up this tree. up there, wasn't I? Sorry about that. Ooh. <laughs> hey, bud, the name's Gus. Feel good to meet you. Look at you, man. Pretty slick taking out crewbits like that, rescuing me from indentured servitude, etc., etc. I love that kind of stuff. You know what? I love that. That's the kind of stuff I love, man. Do you mind if I tag along with you for a bit? I, of course. I, I, that's what I was hoping you'd say. I can use your help. But I should be clear that we are trying to take down the whole G3 cartel, and we might die. Music to my ears. You think I don't want to take down the cartel? Buddy, that's all I want to do. That's all I dream about. Amazing, God. I'm so glad to find another Catlian alive and well. I love your tiny little hands, by the way. I, I, I had a cousin who had those tiny hands. He died in the zombie apocalypse on Gatlas, but, you know, look, I'm sure you don't want to hear about that. We had to live through it. I mean, you know, who wants to talk about that? I shoot this, right? They stick onto certain walls and you can climb with them. See, 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 that's what I'm talking about. Now climb up there. Aren't you glad you met me? Oh shit, time to fight. Oh, okay. No, 
no! I said, said use the vacuum! Use the damn vacuum! Hmm, still a little far away. I'm not sure you can jump to that one. Oh, hey, it's me, Quentin the Grinch again, your best friend. I actually decided to patch things up and rejoin the Jake 3. Do you mind if I kill you real quick? <laughs> Let's see how much you talk when you're dead. Oh, my, oh, I got this. Believe me, I got this. This is the sort of thing I was made for. <laughs> Enough of that guy. They kicked him out of the G3 because he was so damn annoying. He's lonely, he's bitter, and get a life. Some people need a life, and he needed a life, man. 